welcome back to my channel and for those of you that are new i'm glad to have you here today so today i am doing a haul video from michael's if you look a few videos back i did a little mini series of back to school shopping at michael's and i ended up picking up a few things and i got some other things as well but you know, it's Michael's that happens. Well guys, let's go ahead and take a look and see what I actually got. First item I picked up is this red first grade pennant. And as soon as I saw it, I just knew I wanted to get it. And this is done in red. Each grade is done in a different color, so you don't get a choice. But red's fine. It's cute. It's bright. And then there's a satin ribbon on the top and the bottom. And they make it look like bows so it's really super cute really simple and if it's hard to tell the letters are done in white because i know sometimes on different um, monitors it looks different so it's just basic red white with this little wooden handle right here and what really prompted me to pick this up is that i looked at the price and it was just 99 cents so of course I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get it. And this is by Createology. I figured for the price, it's cheaper than me making one and you know, getting all of the supplies and then just creating it in general. So I was really happy to pick this the up. Second item I picked up are these super cute little mini accents. They're in the shape of hands. And you can see they're done in all different skin tones, which I love. You can see there is an example of some of the colors included. And you get 24 pieces. This was only 99 cents. And guys, there are so many ways I'm thinking about using this. For instance, like we can use this to make holiday gifts for parents. We can use this to make turkeys. We can use this for just so many things and it's so much faster, easier, and cheaper than having to get paper and cut them out. So if you're looking for a quick way to get hands, here you go. The third item I picked up is this letterboard set and it is $4.99 and super cute. It says right now, best classroom ever, but you can change it to say whatever you want. And this is made of wood. As you can see, it is standing on its own, but of course, I would recommend you lean it on something or put it against the wall because it'll be easy to knock it over. So definitely, you know, against the wall if you wanna stand it up like this. And let's see the back. Here's a look at the letters, and this contains one letter board and 84 letters for $4.99. A good the deal. The fourth item I have is a pointer, and I absolutely love getting pointers. This one is in the shape of a rainbow. The handle's wooden. Oh, and by the way, this is wooden as well. I know the ones at Target's Dollar Spot are more of a rubber material, but I just love rainbows so i decided to go ahead and pick this up and it does look the same on both sides in case you're wondering and yeah absolutely loved it i believe this was like a dollar 99 i think yeah I, no a dollar a dollar i believe it was a dollar one of those dollar or dollar 99 but it's so cute the next item i picked up is this perpetual calendar and as soon as i saw it i just knew i wanted to get it just because it looks so super cute oh my goodness it's shaped like a little schoolhouse and although the sides are done in a wood like material you can see that the front edge is done in red making it look like a little red schoolhouse it says today is, and then you can see there are the months and the days right there. So again, the material on this is not really thick. It's just like um, a thicker piece of paper that has a little shine to the front. You know what I'm talking about? Like maybe as thick as a as an index card kind of, but with a little shine. So yeah, it's not that thick. I would recommend being really careful so you don't lose the days. And you can see it does stand on its own. Again, it'll knock over easy, so I recommend leaning it or putting it against something so that it doesn't fall over. 
This calendar is $4.99 and it comes with one board and 25 cards. As I was walking around, I finally remembered to pick up another one of these. And for those who are unfamiliar with it, this is called a Large Photo and Craft Keeper by Recollections. The case measures 14.9 inches by 12 inches by 5 inches, and it contains 16 photo cases in a rainbow of colors. And each case holds photos that measure four inches by six inches. So this is so amazing. The colors go from pink to purple, but they also sell them with just clear cases. So you can choose whichever one you want. And yes, you can use this to store your photos or you could do what I do and use them in your classroom or for homeschooling or, you know, for your own kids. There are so many ways you can use this. You can use them to hold stickers. You can use them to hold little crafting beads. Or maybe you make necklaces and bracelets and jewelry. But what I use them for is for classroom items. For instance, I put flashcards in here. And what else? I also use them to hold mini erasers. I use them to separate um centimeter cubes and then i've also used this to create little reading boxes and math boxes so the reading boxes might have things like little magnifying glasses little pointer fingers that sort of thing and for the math boxes i might have things in there like dice centimeter cubes mini erasers anything they can use to count with or read with. So it's really cool, really fun. And I just love having this because basically you open this up and then you have 16 cases. So one for each student. If 16 is not enough, you just get two cases and every student can grab one each. So I just love this and I highly, highly recommend it a price but for some reason they don't have it on here i think regular price was like 40 bucks but i got it on sale for 14.99 next items are pencils and when i saw these pencils i just thought they were so super cute they're 99 cents per pack of 10 and let me go ahead and show you the designs so the first one has a lot of rainbows stars clouds more stars and a little sparkle for that last blue one. But how cute are these? They say things like dream big. The next one over says super. Then you get the rainbow stars and you get that sparkly one. So super cute. Oh my goodness. So of course I had to pick that up. I mean, students do a super job. So I needed that. Well, I wanted that. And then the next one here, I mean, I couldn't resist. It's a foodie one. So if you love food, you'll love this. The first one has cookies. The next one has apples. So the cookies say smart cookie. The next one says hardcore. The next ones are pizzas and it says slice. Slice what? <laughs> I don't know. It says sliced. Um, and then you get the milk and are those sandwiches? That's my jam. Oh, yes. Sandwiches with jam on them. And now I'm wondering what these pizzas say. Hold on a sec. Let me go ahead and flip that over. Maybe I can see. Slice B. Okay, slice B. Huh, I don't know, but, well, they're still super cute. So there they are. They're so adorable. And I'm so glad I got them. I mean, I know I'm not seeing my students right now, but you know what? It doesn't mean I can't make them a goodie bag. Finally, here's the last item I picked up. And yes, these are not school supplies, but it's from their craft section. And these are ribbon scraps, 15 assorted ribbons. They are two yards each, total 30 yards. But I thought, how cute are these? And guys, I've just started getting into crafting i started crocheting and i was thinking to myself you know what maybe i could like maybe weave some of these ribbons into the items i make i don't know you know i'm just starting with the crafting so hopefully i can come up with something creative and i just thought it was fun so why not try right so i think this was either three or five dollars i'm sorry i don't know and for some reason they don't have prices on these so I can't really tell you, but 
I just thought they were pretty cute and it'll be something fun for me so here's to do. Here's a look at everything I picked up today at Michael's and oh my gosh, everything is so super cute and super colorful as usual. So I guess that's why everyone assumes I love rainbows because I guess I do. Oh my gosh, I love things that are colorful. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed watching my video and seeing everything I picked up from Michael's. I hope you like it. I hope you share it with your friends. And if you haven't done so already, I hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day guys.